Good morning, everybody. This is Rick from Quarter Lane Cruisers in Dalton Gardens, Idaho. Today we've got a 69 lemon peeler that I restored uh, a number of years ago as well. Bike turned out beautiful. It's about 90% original parts that came with it. And one thing I'm going to talk about today, I got a call from a customer that's actually out of the country that bought a Coca-Cola bike from me and called and he had damaged it. And what I'm going to do today is talk to people that are considering buying these things. If you're watching this video and you're an adult and you want to get one of the shifter crate bikes, be aware that these bikes were built for children and young adults. Again, these Schwinn Stingrays were built for young adults and children uh, to have fun on. These bikes were not built for adults if you abuse them. And with that said, I drive one, drive around my neighborhood on a couple different crates. These bikes will handle any adult as long as you're careful with them, you ride on asphalt, maybe light gravel, take them to car shows and drive around. But when you start doing jumps and running off of curbs with the full weight of your body, you'll damage these things. And I've had three or four over the hundred or so I've, that came back to me and I had to repair them. And if you do abuse these things, you're going to destroy them. And what usually happens when people take jumps or pop wheelies with these and they come down on the front forks. They'll snap them right there. They'll break them in two. They'll bend the truss rods on these. And what's even worse, after a full-on restoration that I've done they'll crack the tubes right in two I've had to repair two or three of these things and braze them strip them completely back down and paint them another problem these shocks are relatively flimsy you start bouncing up and down on that you'll break them I've seen these things bend and twist. So with that said, I mean, if you're considering buying one, take care of it. Ride the thing. They're fun and enjoyable. And we've got uh, uh, several people here in Idaho that ride these things. And we all enjoy them and have a great time. But we drive around our neighborhood. Uh, and just talk to people. People gives us thumbs up. I used to take them to car shows a lot when I was showing some of my muscle cars. But if you buy one of these things, take care of them and enjoy it. Don't abuse it and take jumps with it because the bikes are not meant for that. Especially now when they're going up above 3,000 and more on a fully restored or one that's in or an original that's in about a seven to eight condition out of 10. These things are more popular now than they ever were. And if you take care of this thing, no matter what you pay for it, and I tell people this all the time, if the price is, is more than fair, even though you might think it's a little bit overpriced, you'll get your money back when you go to sell this as long as you take care of it. And it's, they're actually better investments than a boat, travel trailer, or some other toy that you might buy. Because I sell them to people that both high-end collectors that just want to show them and put them in their starting lineup, so to speak. And I sell them to people that want to ride and enjoy them because they had them when they were a kid. So. If you buy one, enjoy it, but take care of it. They're not meant for adults uh, to take jumps with and, and so forth. Any questions, 530-515-3734.
I hope you enjoyed the video.